Hello, I'm Mohammed Reza Dolat Ullake, a PhD student at University of Strasbourg in France. I'm going to present you our uh, work entitled An Ultra Fast Active Quenching Circuit for a SPED in a 28 nanometer CMOS FTS OI technology. The SPEDs are solid state photodiodes, which are able to detect even a single photon by generating a macroscopic current named avalanche. A main noise source in a SPED is after pulsing. After pulses are spurious non photogenerated avalanches, which are produced by those carriers who are trapped in semiconductor lattice trapping centers. Active quenching circuit is a solution for after pulsing reduction. However, active quenching circuit efficiency in after pulsing reduction mainly depends on its speed in the avalanche detection. On the other word, a faster detection causes a faster quenching and consequently less after pulsing. Many reported active quenching circuits used an inverter as the detection circuit. However, an inverter sensitivity is limited by its MOSFET parasitic capacitance. In our work, we further improve the sensitivity of an inverter by using the body biasing te technique in FDSOI technology. In this technology, MOSFETs are fabricated over a buried oxide layer that allows a designer to bias the body of transistor. By applying the body biasing to an inverter, we can adjust its switching threshold with no parasitic capacitance limitation. Finally, by exploiting both a proper sizing and the body biasing, we design an ultra fast active quenching circuit. Post layout simulation results show that our circuit detects the avalanche in less than 40 picoseconds. That results in an active quenching time of less than 210 picoseconds. To the best of our knowledge, this is the fastest reported active quenching. Thanks to this ultra fast circuit, the area under the avalanche current, which is equal to the avalanche charge in active quenching mode is about 50% less than this area in passive quenching mode. Consequently, our active quenching circuit should reduce the after pulsing up to 50%. Thank you for your attention. I would be pleased to answer your questions.